A Damo State chapter of the All Progressive Congress APC has accused the government under the leadership of Ahmad Fintiri of allegedly claiming projects done by the federal government. In a meeting with all stakeholders in Yola, uh, the party loyalists presented a scorecard of projects done by the federal government across local government of the state. The details are in this report. The representative of the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Abdul Razak Namdas, said the Senators, Member of the House of Representatives, Minister and the First Lady have brought more developments to Adamawa than the state government. He thanked all those elected and appointed by the APC for doing so much to the state in terms of lobbying for projects, bringing empowerment packages, relief materials and job opportunities for the people expressing optimism that with such conduct, the party will reclaim its lost glory come 2023 general elections. According to him, the last APC administration initiated a number of projects to which the incumbent's administration is laying ownership to. The issue of infrastructure in Adamaste, I want to thank the APC chapter in Adamaste specifically for finding time to compile a compendium of so many infrastructural developments that the federal government has attracted to the, to the state. I think that is key. In my own constituency alone, uh, the president has awarded a contract to construct a road between Mahibola to Tongo at the rate of 22.5 or 7 billion. Some of the APC stakeholders said there is no field of human endeavors that the APC government did not touch in the state, adding that the deluge of projects is enticing the state government to secretly visit locations of ongoing federal government's projects in order to deceive the people. We are all here as a to take stock of the performance of our government and our elected representative for the first two years of the four years of the present tenure. Efforts are constantly made by this present government to make sure that Nigerians live in peace, which is good for economic development. And we must also admit that all over the world we have security challenges here and there. Nigeria is not an exception. And we know that Nigeria may be a target. Buhari have done well in some aspects because in terms of development and the welfare of everything he's doing it. But the main problem we have here is security. But in Adamawase, we are very safe and there's no much problem here. It's only like in Madagali area that we have a problem. Why it did a lot. With this release by the All Progressives Congress in Adamawa State, residents are waiting to see if the People's Democratic Party will respond. Until then, only time will tell. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.